my, my question is centered around um, expression of the heart, um, specifically in community. Um, at a certain point in my practice, um, I feel like the like natural expression of my heart got sort of blocked. Um, I, I had a, a spiritual emergency and I ended up in the, um, in the hospital. Um, and it, it's really important, I, I, I feel, to express joy and, and love in the world with others. But I've encountered this really thick sort of story of um, fundamental unworthiness um, in the eyes of humanity. Really just like you know, the, the, the people that I'm around. Um, and I want to know how to enter into the heart of this practice deeply and express that. Um, you know, really courageously and authentically. Dakota, if you go inside yourself, and there are feelings of unworthiness and unlovableness and shame and so on. But if you go back further, what do you find? Uh, a curiosity about it. Okay, good. Yes. Yeah. Go back further. Uh, it's like a, a, a being with it. That's beautiful. Perfect. So first of all, there's the shame that. The, the unlovableness, the unworthiness. Behind that, you're you're interested in it, you're curious about it. And then behind that, before the verbal questioning has arisen, there's just the just being with it. It's perfect. Go back further. I'm not I'm not sure that I can. Okay. Okay, well, let's, let's just stay with the being with it. How does it feel just to be with it? It feels somehow okay. Just okay? Maybe a little more like I can. There's a kind of peace with it. Yes, it's, it's okay. Sounds a little neutral to me. It's I think it, it's warmer than that. Yeah. If you have a friend that you feel okay with, <laughs> not, it's not a not a neutral clinical feeling. You you feel at peace with them. You feel at ease with them. You enjoy their company because. You feel okay, you feel unjudged, you feel accepted, you can be yourself and so on. So that that's the place to go to in yourself, Dakota, to, to go with it. You've got the feelings, the unworthy, the feeling of being unworthy. Then you've got the, all the questions that come up around that, the verbal question of it, but the, and, and that's fine, it, it, it's good to do that, but What's really important is to take that one step further back to, to the, what you call, uh, very accurately, what you call being with it. And feel that the being with it is, yes, it's okay, it's okay but it's more than okay. It's, there's a warmth to it. You're at peace with it. Whatever it is that is being with it is, it, is at peace with it. You could almost say that it's loving, totally open. That, that does, when you're being with it, is there any judgment of the feeling? No. No. It, it's, it's loving in, in a sense that it's 
open, accepting, loving. That's the place to find in yourself. That's the, that's the place to stand in relation to these feelings. More important to stand there, even than to be curious. The, the next layer, when you said, I'm curious to explore it, it's fine to do that. It's good to do that. But more important than that is to regularly go to that place of just being with it and to feel that that place is not a, a neutral clinical place. It's warm. It's peaceful. It's loving. That's the, that's the place to stand in relation to this feeling of being unworthy. And that's the place where your friends stand. Your real friends stand in the same place in relation to this feeling. So the inner feeling is, it's reflected outside of you in your friends. Your real friends have the same feeling of warmth and love towards you and acceptance. And there's a connection between the two, Dakota. There's the connection between your ability to stand as this being with in relation to your own inner feelings. There's a connection between that and the quality of the friendships you will have externally. Your friends will reflect back that feeling to you. So in a strange kind of way, the way for you to go out into the community and meet people and be with people and to feel worthy and to feel loved is to Find that place in yourself that you want to find in your friends. It feels, thank you. It, it, it's, I think, a longer process than <laughs> part of me perhaps wants. Yeah. It, it, it will take time, Dakota, because probably through something in your life thus far, your childhood, something has, has um, it's in response to something in your life that you, that you have this feeling and you've probably been, uh, um, this feeling has been with you probably a long time, you've been compensating for it and, and, and so on. But, but it, it's, not, it's not going to dissolve overnight. But, but this, this being with is the dissolving agent. Just give it time. Thank you. I wish you the very best, Dakota.